This is week nine of the England men's hockey Premier Division. I'm Simon Mason and here are all the goals. Hampstead had to come from behind to end Surbiton's 100% start to the season at Sugden Road. Ben Boone gave Surbiton the lead in the 46th minute. But the visitors fought back as first Matt Guys Brown equalised four minutes later. And then Rupert Shipley scored what turned out to be the winner in the 59th minute. The bottom two met at the University of Exeter with East Grinstead, the visitors. Daniel Faulkner gave EG a dream start with an early penalty corner goal. But the sides were level at half time with a 35th minute goal from Sam Taylor. Exeter then took the lead for Reese Bradshaw's penalty stroke. But East Grinch had turned it around as Lewis Gittins levelled the scoring. Before Ben McKay's 59th minute penalty corner goal gave the visitors all three vital points. Holcomb picked up their third win in a row to further cement their place inside the top six. Goals from Nick Banderak, Tim Guys Brown, and Tom O'Keefe gave Holcomb a three goal advantage inside 27 minutes against Beeston. But the visitors fought back to be just one goal behind at half time as Henry Croft and Gareth Griffiths got on the score sheet. But a second half brace from Rob Field secured the points for the home side. Old Georgians beat Oxted by five goals to one. James Carson put OGs ahead in the second minute before Lewis Fraser levelled the scores up with a penalty corner finish. James Aubrey put his side ahead once more before half time. Second half goals from Ed Carson, Tom Carson, and Dan Shingles put the gloss on the scoreline. Wimbledon hammered Brooklyn's Manchester University, winning 7-0. It took until the 27th minute for the opener as Peter Scott scored. In the second half, the goals started flowing for the home side. Scott got another, followed by a brace of penalty corner goals for Eddie Way. Evan Kimber then got two goals himself before David Condon got the seventh of the match just before full time. The final match of the weekend was Hampstead second as they hosted the University of Durham and came out victors by four goals to nil. Matt Ramshaw got the only goal of the first half before there were second half goals from James Oates, Matt Guys Brown and Joe Sharp. It looks like there are now four teams competing at the top of the table, with Wimbledon top of the table for the time being. 
The battle for the top six looks like it will be going down to Oxted and Brooklands for the final slot, whilst at the bottom, East Grinstead's first win of the season, that victory pulls them away from the University of Exeter.